Yeah, now we're talking. Well, welcome everybody to the, the following contest is a triple threat tables match. And it's for the WCW Hardcore Championship. Introducing the challenger from Hartford, Connecticut, weighing in at 220 pounds, Akira Soon. This is a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael, and judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. Y tenemos a Águila Azul listo para luchar en esta triple amenaza por el campeonato hardcore de WCW. Oh. And introducing the challenger, representing the terrors from your darkest fears. Weighing in at 222 pounds, Crusher. Look out, guys. WCW Hardcore Championship action coming up. Look out is right, Cole. This may very well end up over here next to us. And just so you know, Saxton, if that happens, I'm using you as a human shield. This title match already trending on social media. The challenger knows he has a good chance of becoming champion tonight. Russell from the Terrors. And introducing the champion, representing the legends from San Juan, Puerto Rico, weighing in at 203 pounds. He is the WCW Hardcore Champion, Rodriguez. Corey, what do you think of the champ's chances here tonight? I love him. I'm not like everybody else, Cole. It seems like everybody's ready to write the champ's demise, but not me. Table match underway. It's going to take setting up a table and putting your opponent through it to win. It's the combatant who has the most sadistic mind, who often prevails in these matches. The superstar with the creativity to find an inventive way to use the table. Crash landing powerbomb. A powerbomb's not meant to be pretty, but oh man, does it get the job done. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't want to be taking any more of those. Set right into the corner. Evades the attack. All the way over. Cut for that suplex. He takes control. Oh. He saw that one coming. Punch right in the head. Look at this display of power. Overhead, belly to belly. This is just an overwhelming amount of offense on him. He's got to boost up his levels of aggression at this point. And finds a counter. Corey, what in your opinion makes the biggest difference in a tables match? Remember, he's got to be able to think and move quickly. Survey the damage, explore possible options, and execute accordingly. You have to take the fight right to your opponent. To put yourself in a position to do that, being tentative can cost you big time. You just get the table set it up and make your move all within seconds. He's back into the ring. Uh-oh, watch out! Double Russian leg sweep! It's always good to find a partner in a situation like this, but that can quickly sour. Into the chop block, a debilitating counter there. Face burst. He went right into that turnbuckle. 
Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Look at this display of power, overhead, belly to belly. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. Back in the ring right now. And he clearly knows that as long as he has the kendo stick, he has the power here. Kendo stick to the skull. Able to avoid the arm there. That'll turn your lights out. Letting his opponent know oh, respect is earned, and he's still a dollar short. Uh -oh. Military press! Ooh. And he's out of there in a nick of time. Pride and poise personified. Oh, man, low close lock. Going right after the neck. This is not good at all. The pendulum backbreaker stretch. Oh, look at this. Uh -oh. German suplex. And not done yet. Another German. A trio of wicked German suplexes. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Uh, comes up. Oh, oh. Punch straight to the face, stays off the attack. Oh. Right to the gut. The champ looking out of sorts. Yeah, triple threat matches are no cakewalk, and they are showing us why right now. The pain and punishment it really builds in these type of matches. Now the time to find that second win. Oh no. Perhaps looking for some kind of the champ stands tall once again. A lot of action in that match. Let's have a look. Rodriguez nuevamente retiene. Here is your winner, and still. The WCW Hardcore Champion, Rodriguez! Going through the table like that adds salt to the wound of losing. It's never fun to lose, but the added pain of going through a table is insult to injury. And you can't get much better than the three men who just laid it all on the line here tonight. Sure, only one of them got the W, but all three of them just made it into the history books. Let's continue some more action here on the LVI show.